Dr. Jesse Sanders. I'm the owner and chief veterinarian of Aquatic Veterinary Services. Today we will be talking about white stringy poop in fish. Now, this is our most popular article on our blog, and it's a little concerning to me that so many people are concerned about essentially an empty fecal cast. So I was gonna do this with some visual aids, but I thought it might be a little gross. Now, your intestines, my intestines, your cat, your dog, your fish intestines are aligned with mucus cells. And these little cells help food slide through the digestive tract and out the other end. Now, if a fish, say, isn't getting enough to eat, the water's too warm and their metabolism's moving too quickly, they could essentially shoot out an empty fecal cast that is just the mucus coating, causing that kind of white worm appearance. Many people will be confused and think that this is an internal parasite. And really, unless your fish has been wild caught, so a fish that has been caught in the wild and brought into captivity, which you really should never do, the chance of them having an internal parasite infection is pretty much zero. Um, I have had two cases in my entire career as an aquatic veterinarian, and they were both with wild caught fish. So really, if it's going to be an internal parasite, you will know because you will see that white worm move. And it can be tricky if you have a lot of current in your tank. So the best thing is, is scoop out what you suspect is a parasite in a still cup of water and leave it. If it doesn't move anymore, it's not a parasite. But again, you can have fish with fecal casts if A, they're not getting enough to eat, B, they're getting ready to breed, or C, you have an inappropriate water temperature, which is causing a metabolism to act faster than it should. So it's really important that when you see this, again, it's not too concerning. If all of your fish are producing these fecal casts, be sure to make sure that they're being fed appropriately and that their water temperature is appropriate. For a lot of pet fish species, we're trying to domesticate fish that forage pretty much all the time. Now, you're only gonna feed your fish a couple times a day. So again, you might have some bowel movements that have food in them, and the rest of the day, you know, things are just churning along without any food in there. And that is completely normal. If you have a pet fish species that is not wild caught, you do not have an internal parasite infestation. Trust me, I can tell you from here, it is so rare that in the thousands of cases I have seen, again, I've only had two, and they were both from wild caught fish. So, Again, those white stringy poops that your fish have are completely normal and essentially just the mucus coating from the intestine without any food on them. And there's many normal causes to that, but always be sure to check your water chemistry, check your water temperature in particular, and make sure your fish is being fed an appropriate diet. Thank you very much for joining us for this video. I really hoped you learned something. We have other videos available on our new and improved YouTube site. If you want more information, please visit our website at cafishvet.com. At Aquatic Veterinary Services, fish are treated like family.